Hi everyone, welcome to Apple and Juan. This is Rose Press Fausto and today we have a very special guest. This is Mika Chan. I'm sure we already have a lot of our viewers and our big fans of yours. Oh, I am a fan of The courage! <laughs> the courage to start a company. In a very tender age of? I was 13 when I tried to look for her. <laughs> 13 lang naman. <laughs> so Mika, uh, tell us a little bit about your company, MFP. It used to be Mika Air Tan, but now it stands for? Um, we'd, we'd like to say that it's we're moving forward together, mm -hmm. um, and not just my initials, but uh, we're a private equity group. Yes. Um, and we are focused on three industries, um, finance, uh, uh, healthcare, and food and beverage. And we have presence in 18 cities and 9 countries. Mm -hmm. um, I would like to ask you our secret questions. What do you like to share with us? Your childhood life. Uh, childhood money memories. Um, this is a story I love sharing. My father's a doctor, so when I was young, I would uh, wait for him to come home, and I'd have this little notebook. And you know, I I wondered to myself, why would Dad always be home late? I yeah. never see him. I see him only on Sundays. So what would he be doing as a doctor? And so I had this notebook. He'd come home, and I'd ask Dad how much did he make today, and he said, What kind of Question is that. So he would invent numbers and say 10,000, 1,000, 200, 500. In one day, I said, okay, Dad, how much did you make today? And he said, zero. And I said, you didn't make money today? And I froze and I cried and I said to myself, so what's going to happen if you come home and you didn't make money? And he said, um, that's stuck. Uh, that's stuck. And um, I think that's a lesson that I hold dear. And I said to myself, you know, um, I respect the doctor. They're the most selfless people, doctors. But I said, I want to come home never with a zero. <laughs> <laughs> I like that also. That's so cute. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we're such an auditor at a very tender age. <laughs> How about a curious tip there for millennials who are also starting out their own companies? Wow. Um, one, it would be stay close to amazing women leaders like Rose Fausto. <laughs> um, I just want to share, I've been following her for years. Um, I didn't expect that um, we would actually have, you know, um, a, series, have a date today. A date. <laughs> and um, also I want to share that I think the tip, I'm recently married. <laughs> yes, yes! Recently yes. married and um, I think my tip would be do something that your future children would be proud of. Um, and I think uh, Rose has done it um, tremendously well. And I'm looking forward to learning from her more. And it's really um, fail forward. Um, if, if you've never failed before, then you're in trouble. Yes, but you haven't tried it. <laughs> you haven't tried. Um, if you have failed, keep on. We all have. We all, some in different aspects of our lives are still failing. But always to move forward together with the right. Yes, and of course, hindi kita pa kapa wala na. Kasi ako, I heart weddings talaga. I'm a ro I'm a hopeless romantic. <laughs> hindi, hopeful romantic. Um, can you just share with us what made you think that this is it? This is it. This is the time to get married? Yeah, and he's the first one. And he's the right one? Well, I was lucky enough to end up with my first love. Oh my, so if you followed her, which I have, you've heard of that story. That heartbreak. That heartbreak? Mm -hmm. that, that guy who's also partially responsible for your yes. being a very yes. young entrepreneur, right? Okay, and, um, so continue. Nako <laughs> <laughs> love story, ang usapan na. Uh -huh. um, so, we met when we were 16. Um, we were together for two years. We didn't talk for six and a half years. <laughs> um, I still stayed um, in good relations with his family. I think that's one also very important. Never burn bridges. Yeah. I mean, you can be you can be in arguments now, but in the next few years, I think make an effort to patch things up. And um, I 
eventually uh, he came back into my life um, and after seven years um, we're husband and wife oh my God. <laughs> so that heartbreak um, he's now my husband my gosh it's totally mended <laughs> it's mended he is the first to break my heart and the last to mend it <laughs> you know what I really really wish you a great Thank you so much. Diba, as I told you over lunch, eh? in a great marriage, your joy is double and your sorrow is cut in half. Oh, I memorize. <laughs> so, so be good. Yes. <laughs> I wish you well and any parting words for our viewers? Uh, well, I think these opportunities to share um, not only the successes but also the struggles that we had. Um, is what's valuable the most um, and just keep on keep moving forward um, with the right people and uh, fail forward also. Yeah. Thank, you, thank, thank you very you so much, much. my dear <laughs> and pagka uh, pregnant yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> thank you very much that has been Rose Press Pops from